welcome back to my channel. My name is Gabrielle and I'm a senior in high school. In today's video, I'll be making my cat a Harry Styles cardigan. I was inspired to do this video because I saw another YouTube video that was maybe like two minutes long and someone was just making their cat a Harry Styles cardigan. And I was like, hmm, I bet I can make like a fun video about that. And if you guys want, I could probably make a tutorial. August is my favorite cat ever. I have another cat and another dog, and I was gonna make a crocheting my pets outfits video or something like that, but I just wanna focus on August today. Here he is, he's in my lap, being all cute. A few years ago, my mom and my older sister went to the pet store to buy dog food and they came back with kittens. And one is Frankie, he's gray and white and he is pretty scrawny compared to August. August or Augie is the other cat and he he's pretty weird. A lot of times I'll like go on a walk or something and I'll come back, he's, he's literally sitting in, a ch in our front porch chair, guarding over our house. August will just always be my favorite cat. I know you're not supposed to have favorites, but I just do. So first August, let's find out if you are a warm tone or a cool tone cat to see what shades of colors will look best on you, don't you think? He's gonna sleep on it. Here's what I got. It's for the next couple of videos, so. So I have two needles, my scissors, and my little pouch. I carry this pouch everywhere. It's kind of falling apart in some areas because my needles like poke through it. I should probably figure out a better bag, but like it's my measuring tape and my little crochet needle and safety pins and stuff. You should have like a little crochet bag with you. It's very helpful. Okay, August, do you want a double crochet stitch or do you want half double crochet stitch? Hmm? Me too. Half double crochets are prettier. all of the squares. I'm so excited. Okay, so now that I've finished all the squares, it's time to actually start constructing August's cardigan. So I'm going to start laying these out kind of in an order and then I'll start sewing them together, I guess, and trying out on August periodically to make sure that it's going to fit him. Okay, so I just tried to get Augie's measurements. Not sure how that went, but I'm just going to sew on the sleeves 
um, which is this thing. <laughs> and I'm just gonna fold it in half and make like a little arm sleeve and attach it here. That way when I fold it over his body, I can, he can put his feet through there. And then I'm gonna do the same thing for the other side. And then I'm gonna figure out how to make the sides and the belly part. So we'll have to do some more measurements because most of the try-ons did not go very well so far. So yeah, once I have the sleeves, then he'll actually like be attached to it and then I can get more tangible measurements. Okay guys, so I did a little bit of sewing. My cat is outside, so I can't try it on yet, but look how cute this is. So I have, it's like a little shirt. The next thing that I'm thinking of adding, but I need to try it on him first, is blue down the center, and then around the head part, some red. That's the idea. But I gotta go try this on him if I can find him outside. Okay, Mr. August. Oh, you're such a good kitty. Put your hand through here. Oh, how do you feel, Augie? You look so cute. So now I'm adding the little front parts that go down the sides of the cardigan. And I'm adding that in blue. It's actually crazy how quick it was to make this compared to the actual Harry Styles cardigan. I mean, that seems like a dub because this is so small. I remember the actual Harry Styles cardigan took me like a month. And I had, I was still a beginner at the time. So me, I thought I could make it in a day. And that was a mistake. And then I was like, oh, I can make it in two days. So I was literally trying to finish this in two days, crocheting it 24 seven, and it ended up taking me like an entire month, which is just kind of funny. Okay, so I added the red border on the top and now I'm working on the ribbing part, which will go all the way down this part. And maybe you know this, I don't know, but ribbing is one of my least favorite parts of crocheting. This isn't so bad, but yeah, August, I really hope you enjoy wearing this. Also, it's the last month of like winter winter where I live, which is in the Midwest of the United States. So I thought it was the perfect time to make August a sweater because there's still some days where it will be nice and chilly out for sure a random side note just while i'm crocheting is i'm starting to gain a lot of subscribers and i want to say thank you to everyone who's subscribing and leaving super nice comments on my videos i really appreciate those and they make my day but also i have some really fun like video ideas that were the reason i actually started posting on youtube which is involving you guys so I'm gonna make videos where I react to your creations. So definitely send me some pictures of your favorite things that you've made on Instagram. Even later on, I wanna do like the subscriber cardigan idea. So if you wanna participate in those videos, definitely follow my Instagram and subscribe to my channel. Additionally, I have a subscriber chain and I added it to my last thank you for joining my channel video. So there's 50 subscribers on that chain so far, but my channel has recently grown a lot because a few of my tutorials have gotten a lot of views. So I'm gonna have to start adding you guys to my chain and I was planning on doing that when I get to a thousand subscribers. So if you wanna join my subscriber chain, definitely cl click the red button. Okay, so the sweater is officially completed. Um, we have a cute little collar in the top, some ribbing down at the bottom, and our sleeves. So it's time to try this on August. Augie! Good morning! <laughs> don't worry. Don't even worry. Don't, don't even worry. <laughs> We're just dressing you. 